Oh, uh, hello, welcome to the Wow. So it's single battle. Previous season was rank nine. Oh yeah. I got a mystery band. Great job. I got a mystery gift. Let's check it out, dudes. Let's check it out live. Let's get that mystery gift. What will it be? Uh. <laughs> it's probably gonna be something. Nothing. Uh. Let's see. Look at all this stuff. Oh, that's just like a receipt of what I received so far. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's up. I'm wasting time. All right, not too much time, but yeah, let's get it going. Yeah, great ball seven, eight, whatever. Yeah, for some reason my single score was like taken. Probably because there are less people that do singles. Um, if I were to guess. <laughs> This doubles is more competitive because there are more people to play it. That's just how it goes. So this team should be banned if the rule set has not changed, and I'm sure it hasn't. Yeah, one or more of my Pokemon cannot participate. It's only Gyarados, actually, that's funny. I could just make that Gyarados a Gastrodon, and that team would work perfectly well. Um, I'll use UA team again. Because I don't need to swap anybody. I do feel like Gyarados is really important for that team. Because it uh, has Flying Stab. And can cover... Uh, I don't know. Gyarados just fits perfectly. We're fighting another rank 7 in Great Ball 2 right now. And they are... Wow, that's a very strong team. That's a really, really strong team. Um, yeah. Uh, well, we got a Winkle Fable because, uh, Urshifu's on the team. That's just pretty much how it goes. Tangrowth looks pretty good. Um, leading Gengar seems pretty excellent since Pursuit doesn't exist. And if he goes Urshifu, I can just hard swap to Clefable, who can take, should be able to take, uh, Wicked Blows. It's max defense and whatnot. Um, I guess that's it. I don't feel... Hmm. Yeah, no, that, that that works really well, because I shouldn't worry about Grimmsnarl, since it is also weak to Clefable. In fact, his whole team is weak to Clefable, except for, like, Cat Turn, and, like, his ground type, and his normal type, which his normal type doesn't want to fight Gengar anyway, uh, and Clefable can beat it. Um, I don't know, I feel this should be workable. Almond, chocolate almond milk with my uh, black coffee. If you mix it together, it almost tastes like chocolate milk, um, except it's caffeinated. It's like caffeinated chocolate milk. It's pretty tight. Uh, so, Japanese person is gonna lead with their shifu. Yeah. I'm not surprised. It's the water one. Oh shit, it's the water one. I can uh, blow his face off with Thunderbolt then. Um, hmm, okay, so if I'm gonna do that, I might as well Dynamax because, you know, just because. Um, yeah, no, I'll do it. Just to, because he might Dynamax also. He, he might also Dynamax. Because Dynamaxing with their Shifu is pretty skillless. Like, I expect people to do it a lot. And uh, if you've been paying attention, we're high rank in singles. And Ishifu's on every team, so it's like, yeah. The Fable's good in singles. What can I tell you? No, will they just knock him out? That's the question. Aha! Uh -huh. He's scarfed. Uh, as long as he doesn't hit me five times, I'm fucking good. Please, uh, can I curse that? Yeah, right. Cool. So, Dynamaxing is actually really huge there, because that means the Scarfer is probably dead. Yeah, the Scarfer is dead. 
Yeah, man, Dynamax turn one. It's it's good, especially if you only have three Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people, including Japanese people, have been running Choice Scarf, Water, or Shifu because it can get surprise kills by outspeeding uh, Pokemon like Gengar. I uh, I anticipated him attacking, so I Dynamaxed, and it obviously worked out because Dynamax is broken. So the Dynamax option covers pretty much like. A lot of shit. Um, I can just go for the G-Max Lightning because it's powered up. I see no problem with this. It should do a lot and he'll probably Dynamax in return. I don't see why not. But if he does Dynamax he won't be able to boost so I don't think he will Dynamax immediately. Uh, and that did a freak load of damage. Agility? Are you high? <laughs> what are you gonna do to me? Are you gonna agility and, and G Max? Like, that seems like the only uh, real option, which he could knock me out, I guess. Um, but yeah, I think the Fable beats that. Oh, Tangrowth does too. So agility plus dynamics. And you can do that with Rhyperior and you can do it with Porygon Z as well. Which is what my opponent has done. Um, yeah, speed boosting is really good in singles. Speed boosting is less good in doubles. In doubles you want to focus on debuffing your opponent. Um, I have learned how to do singles and doubles competitively now because I'm so obsessed with this game. Um, Yeah, no, I'll just throw a wish. There, he can't do anything about that. <clears throat> and he'll, um, I think he'll debuff one of my defenses, or I don't know what I'll do. I'll probably go for the normal move. I'm just gonna throw a wish. Uh, the interesting thing about Dynamax Pokemon is, oh shit, never mind, I just get fucking destroyed. Alright, <laughs> the interesting thing is, fuck me. Alright, I, I actually lose. Because I underestimated Porygon Z. I totally underestimated Porygon Z. Um, that's really bad. Yeah, wow, okay. Well, I guess Agility Porygon Z will knock me out. Yep, Agility Porygon Z is going to knock me out. Wow, that is rough. That is really rough. Um, I should have not uh, sacked for Fable. I'm gonna lose now. Wow. So yeah, the funny thing about Dynamaxing is if you do it first and you don't knock out enough Pokemon, you auto-lose. <laughs> like, that's just kind of a fucking fact. Like, yeah. Zone Hail will take him down, but I, I played badly there because I should have I should have hit Protect at least. I should have uh, at least gone for Protect. This is my first loss in singles uh, in a long time. I think I've only lost two or three times. Yeah. So I definitely lose to this thing, but if I had Diggers B on the team, I would have been fine. It's just that kind of a thing. This is the first time I've been taken down. Yeah. The resisted Bolt Beak will do it, but I, I could have definitely won that. Yeah, wow. Wow. So I guess if I don't select Diggsby, I lose. That's that's also something. So, Clefable Diggsby. Ha ha, fuck me. We'll take some time. Sure. <clears throat> Let's see if we can beat the rank at least. Or something. Zero and one. It's not good. Uh, it's the same team. <laughs> it's it's actually the same team. Well, uh, huh.
I don't think he will be bringing his uh, uh, Corsola. It seems real apparent to me that Diggersby lead, that you turn into a playable is just the way, like, this is the fucking way, like, <laughs> saving Dynamax is good, and I don't think Gengar will actually make it this time. I think we're gonna go for Rotom, since he has so many, uh, water, he has two water types, and Rotom is a fine Dynamax Pokemon, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, that choice Scarf or Shifu would have killed my Diggersby too. So my opponent, I think he did just kind of outplay me there. But I did choke in a big way by not going Protect. And I really should have gone into Tangrowth first as well. That's, that's like another thing. It's it's like, it's like if you have ta if you have Tangrowth on your team, you might as well use him. So he doesn't have an Air Balloon. I'm just gonna earthquake. These things are like always sashed, right? I'll show him my scarf right now, but if that gets me a free kill, it's worth it. But he's oh, is he? He's gonna be like. Um, I think we're getting. Oh shit! <laughs> yeah, we're getting into like the really good people, man. Yeah, I, sh I mean, if I U-turn there. Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I don't think Endeavor works in Dynamax Pokemon because Dynamax is broken. So I'm going to do that because I think this thing definitely is Endeavor and um, his Quick Attack Rock move. <sighs> uh... Yeah, I'm getting played this episode. Wow. If I, if I can't win, I might just uh, close it out and uh, make it a short one because, yeah, it's kind of sad. Yeah, we Dynamax first, which means we're probably going to lose, because that's how this game works. You want to save your Dynamax? Hey, this game is dumb. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah. Let's watch as I get destroyed. Alright, cool. Excel Rock. That's cool. So I can set up a Max Lightning, and he almost certainly has a Water type that's coming up next. I think? I think this is going to work out, but that's what I thought about Clefable. I really, un really underestimated Porygon Z. Yeah, we're in the upper, uh, upper, upper levels now. We're gonna start seeing very strong things like this Pokemon. And what is he gonna do? He's gonna, he's gonna get hit. Can you live one? I don't think you can live one because this guy has to. Well, he might live one because he's Dynamaxing. I don't know. But it's I've, okay. I've got the lightning boost. I think he should actually be good. And I, I, I want to say Lapras are like special attacking. Like might even run speed. You know, like we we might knock it out. Yeah. <laughs> oh wow. We don't even do half. What the fuck? All right, we're gonna lose to Lapras. <laughs> In doubles, I can beat Lapras because I have dual screens. I don't have dual screens on this team. So now he has new. He's basically killed my Dynamaxer because I'm gonna have to uh, hit him two more times, and he's probably going to max protect. No. Okay. Oh, that looks like a nice crit. Okay, that's good. <laughs> he would have. He definitely was in a better situation than I was, and I locked him out because I crit through his Aurora Veil. And just seeing how fast that health dropped, yeah, I was like, yeah. Okay, so I, I think I do win now. <laughs> I actually do win because I'm special attack, um, speed Rotom, and this is his last, and I will just nasty plot. Wee. 
What will you do about this? Will-O-Wisp. Yeah. Will-O-Wisp is not gonna do shit. I'm surprised you brought this. Yeah, you can hear my loud sneezing. Yeah, we, we sneeze like we're being stabbed in our family. And my mom sneezes ten times. Maybe eleven times. Quarantine life in America, 2020. She can't be blamed anymore. It's good. I'm gonna go for this. Doesn't do anything. Well, <laughs> I mean, this doesn't do anything either. Um, am I really gonna die to burn? No, I got Clefable. No, there's no way I'm gonna die, but this is gonna take a long time, because he, he is gonna stall me out as much as he can. Unless this thing is Nightshade. Oh, it does. Well... Shit! <laughs> oh, okay. I forgot all about the Veil, because I crit through it. Um, yeah, I don't know. I've been doing that a lot with Throat and Wash, where I nasty plot and then he faints. We should probably just attack more. So, time to call mine to plus six and win. I've got Wish. You should probably run. I'll pee pee stall you. <laughs> like, this is what's happening now. And I have PP maxed Wish and uh, all that jazz, so I'm gonna win. That just is what it is. They're gonna run out of Nightshade eventually, you know. Oh. Well, they're not gonna run out of Strength Sap so much, but. Yeah. So if we're talking about PP stalling? Nah, that's not gonna work. Because I have Wish. And I just wasted a wish. <laughs> I just wasted one of my wishes, because I... Whatever. Oh my god, yes! Christ! Yeah, I heard about that. I don't... It's a very depressing life right now, because Trump has butt-fucked everything, and I have no amount of privacy, because gotta live here. It's fucked me. Yeah, let's make this a nice toxic episode. Nice and toxic. Watch as I lose to this. Hmm. <laughs> hate this game. <laughs> I fucking hate this game so much. Like, I was gonna talk, I really was gonna talk about how, like, the uh, rated singles and doubles VGC type metagame is actually a lot more competitive than Smogon is right now, believe it or not. Because Nintendo actually implemented a giant ban list. I'll just protect. Yeah, use your nightshade. Do it, dude. Yeah. Um. But yeah, uh, Game Freak actually implemented what is that? Thirteen, fourteen Pokemon ban list. This is old news now, but it's been rolled over to this month's meta game. When I watched a Wolfie video, and he it was a clickbait video where he straight up lied to me, and he said that. The next uh, metagame was going to be a repeat with Dragapult and stuff, and that just didn't happen. So, yeah. I guess I'll start Moonblasting. Plus three. Just, <laughs> just leave, sir. Just leave. Ooh, that's nice. Alright, I win now. Ugh. But yeah. This is a really tough episode, because... Uh, my family is really loud, and I lost the first match. But we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna beat this thing. 
And that's a nice 20 minute braided singles for you. Whoop de doo. I really didn't. <laughs> yeah. I think I underestimated my, underestimated my opponent in both times, which you should probably never do. But, yeah. That worked out for me. Nah. Uh, we'll quit for now just because I don't. Oh, fucking Christ, I didn't want to do that. Uh, we'll, we'll quit for now. Because I don't want to make it too long. But I'll, I'll do this later. Alright. How am I subscribed?